Hey, in today's video, we are going to take a look closer at a new WordPress plugin called Google Publisher plugin. So uh, this is Google Publisher plugin page in WordPress plugins directory. And you see uh, it has many reviews, five stars or even one stars. It's interesting to read uh, them. And what I like from this plugin is actually it's ca it can easily add AdSense in your uh, site and uh, at your site to webmaster tool in just one click so you can read this page from the descriptions or installations and the screenshots and so forth but for now let's take a look and install it in our site so first of all you're going to log in to your um, Google account so I log in already in google.com and this is my webmaster tool uh, account and the next is you go to your dashboard of your WordPress site. I'm using how to use WordPress 3.info. So I'm already logged in. And then next is going to plugins and add new. And here you're going to search for Google plugin for publishers. Search for that and scroll down until you find this plugin, Google publisher plugin in beta and create it by Google. And you can click on details to read. And after you uh, read some of infos, you can click install now. I mostly read the description and installation. So for now, we're going to just click install now button and then activate plugin. Clicking activate plugin. Now that we see that Google Publisher plugin is already activated, go to settings. And the first step that you're going to see when you activated Google Publisher plugin is that this boxes. So you know that you will need to sign in to your Google account, especially this plugin, because it will add your site automatically to Google Webmaster tool and add AdSense in your uh, site. So let's get started by clicking on get started and make sure that you already log into your Google account. And if you don't have a Google account, you just click on create one now. So I'm just going to hit get started button. And you see now I'm right directed to this uh, page. So I'm going to verify and we are now waiting that it will be verified in Google uh, Webmaster tool. You see that this site is verified and you can also click manage site that will bring you to uh, your Webmaster tool uh, account in Google. And as you can see my AdSense is also um, activated so you see I have now inside my dashboard I can see my performance reports and so forth or click minutes ads from here now this is the part that I really like from this Google Publisher plugin so if you go to your minutes ads and it will analyzing your site and without adding some plugins that you don't know whether this plugin uh, solid or not you see now it has plus button that you can add your adsense on this uh, in this area of your page so let's go to post tree so as you can see if you have many uh, articles in your site you see that it has even the plus button over there and you can just click on them to display your ad so in the past it would be needed a plugin or code to add your AdSense inside your content. So let's say now I'm going to add this plus button to insert my ads here and you can, as you can see, you can uh, see the preview of the ads here. And if you want, you can also click on the setting to know what kind of uh, ad format, say a rectangle and text and display ads. So just hit close and it will be appearing in your site. It might take a few minutes for Google to update it, but as you can see, it's now very easy to add AdSense inside your content. You can also choose on single page and so forth and preview it. If you want to have it as it is or as you just modify it, just click on save and activate it. And now it's, uh, it's already activated. Go to open your site in new window. Just hit close button and go to our site again. So this is our post tree. We click it it will add automatically the ads here. It's not displaying now because I've just activated. So as I mentioned earlier, you need to wait for a few minutes. So let's go to post two to see if this one also added here. So once you add it in one post and I think Google uh, plugin will be added automatically whenever you create posts. So that's it guys, our quick tips for WordPress today and thank you for watching. Goodbye.